Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a recent beauty favourites. Um, you guys always ask for these kind of videos. Um, so I thought I would bring you one today. But before we get started, if you are new around here, hello, my name is Sarah Jane. I make videos on all sorts of lifestyle things from cleaning videos to baby updates because I have a 10 month old baby girl. Um, you will find hauls different things so if you like to watch a variety of different things then please hit that subscribe button or if you are already subscribed then click that bell button because you will be notified of when my videos go live so the first thing I'm going to talk about is this new hairbrush which I bought just recently it's actually from Boots I still haven't taken off this little bit here <laughs> I don't know why just haven't been able to find some scissors to um cut it off when I actually think about it but this is a paddle brush but it also has kind of smaller bristles within the uh, lo longer bristles and that really helps to like smooth your hair and make it really soft Um, I'm sorry there is still in ha hair in there I tried to get it out but I've been using it so you know I think you can forgive me for that <laughs> So it says SP here, I think that stands for Salon Pro but it's definitely one of the Boots brands and it was around £8. I'm sorry, my memory is so, so terrible that I can't remember how much it was. It was at 8 or £10, it was definitely left less than 10 but I've been really liking that and I've noticed the difference in my hair and I also find that my hair has been drying a lot faster than the brush that I was normally using so definitely recommend that. As always, I'll leave links in the description box below of everything that I talk about. The next thing I've been loving is this Kiehl's Glow Formula Skin Hydrator. I've been using this um, before I put my makeup on. It actually looks like it has um, a tint to it, but um, it actually doesn't. That is the colour of the pomegranate in the product itself, but it just acts as a really nice almost like a tinted moisturiser but it's not a tinted moisturiser but I just think it gives a really nice um, glow to the skin before you put your makeup on it feels really nice um, and hydrating and I've been loving that I was actually uh, lucky enough to be given some um, products to try uh, when I went to a show a couple of months ago and this was one of them and I just really really like it I tend to be quite a creature of habit when it comes to project uh, products and things because I know what I like and I stick to it so the only time I try new things which is really bad is if I'm gifted them um, and I'm really glad that I was gifted this because it's just really really nice and I definitely recommend it Another thing that I was gifted just recently and this comes as no surprise that I love their products because if you've followed me for a while you will know that I absolutely rave about Bare Minerals and this is the Lash Topia. Now as I said before I tend to stick to what I like and when it comes to mascara I would use Volume Million Lashes and I've used that for years and years and years. Um, and I like the fact that it has rubber bristles on it. So when I saw this one and saw that it was just, you know, normal bristles, I was like, oh, I don't know if I'm going to like it. However, when you look at the bristles, you can see that they actually go shoot off in all different directions. So they're not dead straight. And the thing that I like about that is when you're actually putting it on your lashes, it kind of separates them um, and coats them really, really well. So I'm super, super impressed with this. So it says mega, mega volume mineral based mascara and this is in ultimate black. So I always do like to go for sort of really black, uh, the blackest ones that you can get. Um, but yeah, Bare Minerals Lash Topia. Again, I'm so pleased that I got sent this so that I could try it because otherwise I don't think I would have. Um, love, love, love. In fact, I think I might have been completely converted to this one. Sorry about the lighting, guys. It's really strange weather today and it kind of keeps going a li little bit strange. So, I know that I've just said that I don't try new things, but... When it comes to lipsticks, that's probably the main thing that I will 
buy um, and try out different ones. But there are so many lipsticks that I've bought and thought they would be good for me, but I just haven't liked them. And I've just found a few really nice ones recently. Again, I was sent this one, um, but I love it. When it comes to nudes, because I haven't naturally cropped I can't speak today. When it comes to nude colours, I have naturally quite red lips. So if, um, you know, like a standard nude that you would get, like a quite a creamy nude, they just don't look good on me at all. I tend to find that more pinky nudes are better for me because the redness in my lips already like warms it up. So this one here is by Bare Minerals again. It's the Gen Nude Collection and it's called Can't Even and it's just really, really nice. This is actually one that I have on now. I have just put the gloss over um, another lipstick which I'm just about to show you. So this combination of lip colours is um, all down to Lucy Jessica Carter. If you don't know her, which I'm sure you already do, but I'll leave a link in the description box below to her channel. Um, so she uses the Barry M lip liner in rose. And this is really, really nice. Again, it's kind of a warmer nude color, more of a pinky nude. And then this is the Rimmel London, the Kate Moss collection in the number three and this is really nice this is probably a bit more brown that i would normally go for but again it is a little bit warmer what i tend to find with this is i like to put on uh, this one this is one that i've had for ages it's like a creamy color um a creamy gold and i just find again it just warms up um, this one so I actually put those um, two on together this is the max factor in vanilla shade 852 I've had this for so long so I don't know if you can still get it I combine both of those together and it just gives a really nice result I've actually worn this color combination on a night out when um, I wanted a little bit more of a bolder lip um, but for today because I, uh, people always ask me what I've got on my lip Today I have the Kate Moss one in number three and then the Bare Minerals one over the top um, and I also have the lip liner on as well. Another love of mine is perfumes and this doesn't come under the category of I don't like to try new things because I love to try new perfumes, especially if I smell them on people I tend to buy them, I have a drawer full of them. Anyway, I came across this one. This is Zara White Jasmine and it's so beautiful. And the best thing is, it's five pounds. <laughs> um, I just really liked the size of this one because it's just really nice to go in a bag. Um, just chuck in there. Um, you won't worry too much about how much you're spraying on yourself because it's five pounds. Um, it's just really, really nice. So I would recommend this if you wanted to buy it as a present, like a little stocking filler. It's never too early to start thinking about Christmas, but this is just really, really nice. And then I'm going to talk about body products. Now I was sent these. Um, they asked me if I wanted to try out their coconut range. Coconut, you just say coconut to me and I'm all over that straight away. I love coconut scent. So this is SBC Simply Beauty and this is the coconut and plumeria. I think I'm saying that right. Um, this is the shower melt and the shower gel. This is just really nice because it's kind of got a shimmer to it but without being like in your face shimmer. So it's just really nice lightweight smells beautiful um, and I'm really looking forward to taking this on holiday with me because it's not too heavy on the skin but it's also very moisturizing and gives that slight um, like shimmer to your skin but without looking like a ball ball. <laughs> um, it's just really really nice so it just gives you that nice healthy glow and they have the shower melt and the uh, shimmer um, skincare gel. So I've been loving those at the moment. Smells 
so so beautiful so there we go there are a few things that i've been loving this month if there's anything in particular you would like to hear me talk about leave me a comment down below and i'll be sure to get a video together for you but thank you so much for watching if you did like it give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and i shall see you again in my next video bye guys